one of my pollen traps. I actually had this one given to me a while ago, but uh, I started making them myself though. Uh, this little screen right here, you see it. This one here, I should have grabbed a different one. There's going to be a little knob right here to turn. So I'll just put a screw in it for now. But anyway, you turn that, it lifts that screen up here. This goes out in front of the hive. I'll show you guys how it's set up later. But that goes out the hive, out the front of the hive. You lift this up for a couple of days and let the bees get used to this being out of the hive and crawl through, you know. Once they start getting used to that, you close that back down. And once that's closed, there's crawl through the little squares there and it knocks that pollen off. The pollen will fall into this little tree here. Okay, I'll close that back up. That's all it is too. This one's pretty straightforward and simple to use. But, uh, it works pretty good. I said I, I'm gonna put one out here this evening and I'll show you guys how it's how it goes out of hive. It just screws out the front of the hive. Pretty easy. So just I'll show you guys this real quick. See ya. Yep. I just put it up here just a couple minutes ago. I said the screws to the hive. They've already started figuring out to go in it. Not all of them. I don't see fly around. There's quite a few learning to go in now. Already that fast. But uh, yeah, this one's given to me here. I had a bunch of these ones given to me. And I started making some too, and the new ones I'm making. Actually, can bring it some of the other older ones too now, so I can just hook them straight to the hive. They'll have to screw it to the hive. I'll show you those ones later. See ya.